So someone was crazy enough to give me the keys to this 2014 Mercedes S-Class. <laughs> Now you already know that it's comfortable and it handles well and it's fast, so I've decided to go over some of the more ridiculous features that you might not know this car has. For example, every single light in this car is an LED and you can change the color based on your mood. Just go into the menu, select ambient light color, and you can pick, for example, red if your golden parachute didn't work out like you wanted it to. Or blue if you're taking your secretary out for a nice romantic evening on the town. It even works in the back. Speaking of the back seat, each rear passenger has 15 buttons to choose from on the door panel. Now these four are simple. You have the sunshade, and of course, the window. And for some reason, you can control the sunshade in the window on the other side also. You also have the sunroof. And the rear sunshade, in case you want to be in total privacy. Now these buttons are more straightforward. You have your typical seat controls, your headrest, your footrest. And it's heated, it's cooled. And of course there are memory settings. But then over here you have my personal favorite button, the one that moves the front passenger seat all the way forward. And when you're sitting here reclined with the front passenger seat all the way forward, you can put your head back on this nice suede pillow and push this button and a mirror comes down so you can stare at yourself. Another backseat luxury is just how easy it is to find the seat belt once you've opened the door. I also have this great remote I can use to turn on the navigation system, turn up the stereo, make a call. Life is good in the backseat of an S-Class. But this car isn't all about the people in the back. There are still some perks to sitting in the front seat. My favorite is the heated armrest. To turn it on, go back into vehicle settings and search through the myriad of menus until you find panel heating. And then when you're in, you can choose which armrests you want to heat. None of them, front ones, rear ones, all of them. Mmm, toasty. You also don't just put on your seatbelt. Instead, it automatically tightens around you. It's like a hug from Mercedes-Benz. Also, do you want a massage while you're driving? No problem. It is, once again, located in the infotainment system. You just find the massage tab and choose your desired intensity. Mmm, relaxing. But you can do more than just massage yourself. You can, for example, adjust your shoulder bolsters. You can adjust how high and how intense you want your lumbar support to be. You want more backrest support? Done. You can tell us the system where you want the heated seat balance to be. On the backrest, on your butt. And most importantly, it has a dynamic multi-contour seat, which means as you turn the corner, a bolster comes out and helps keep you in place. And for those of you who missed the original Grand Theft Auto games, the 360 degree camera provides a perfect top-down view of the car while you're driving. There's also a system that monitors your lane and steers you back on course if you start to drift out of it. Now, if you have a problem with all these features, you can always consult the owner's manual. Oh wait, there isn't one. Instead, you have to go back to the infotainment system that you probably can't figure out in the first place for another round of S-Class technology. So just to sum it up, this car, being ridiculous. 